My name is Kelsey Johnson. Um, I am the coordinator for the Arboretum, and I have been with the Arboretum since October of 2016. Our community garden, the focus of our garden, is to provide free, fresh produce for all students. 99% of the produce does go to the students, so either through Knight's Pantry, um, which is located in Farrell Commons. Um, we take produce there um, pretty much every day. How do you feel about the relocation of the garden? Initially, um, I was a little worried about it um, because the, the place in which the garden is currently has been there since 2009. Um, so since 2009, um, you know, all of the soil that's been added there, it's really been accumulating for uh, many years. Um, so the soil over there is really, really wonderful. Um, it's very healthy soil for a vegetable garden. Um, but the area that we will be moving it to um, is bigger, so our, the new garden will be about twice the size of our current garden, so we'll get to produce um, a whole lot more, and we might have, because we'll be producing more, um, we might have other opportunities to donate um, extra produce out into the community, um, or you know, other entities on campus, potentially. Do you view this as a more of a positive thing? Yes, so I, um, I think it is a positive thing, um, even though, you know, we're kind of being pushed out by construction, it's not necessarily that bad, um, because the place we're moving it to um, is a space that uh, can't ever really be built on, so once we put it in this, um, it's more of a permanent location. Along with the chill water plant that's currently there that's almost reached completion, um, they will be adding um, a cell tower to kind of, I guess, increase the amount of cell service that you can get on campus, increase the connectivity, I suppose. So rather than trying to work with it, we're just going to completely move it to a different location. It's been considered to move the garden in replacement for the cell phone tower. Do you worry that they might try and do something like that again? There's always kind of that worry, but one thing that kind of does protect us a bit is that a lot of our site here is a jurisdictional wetland. It's been considered to move the garden in replacement for the cell phone tower. Do you worry that they might try and do something like that again? Um, there's always kind of that worry, but one thing that kind of does protect us a bit is that um, a lot of our site here is a jurisdictional wetland. Um, it's a part of you know law that you can't really build structures or anything on a wetland. Okay. Um, so since we have this site classified as a wetland, um, it's relatively difficult for them to build much else. Um, and the area that we're moving the garden to is classified as that wetland. Um, and because we're not building a structure, the most structure-like thing that we would be building is our fence, um, our deer fence. Um, but that's not classified as a true structure. Um, so we're not really worried about um, this happening again because, you know, the way uh, that kind of it is now, everything is a wetland. So there shouldn't be any building on it, um, you know, kind of period. This new irrigation system will be using a drip irrigation system. It doesn't waste a lot of water. It's actually better for the crops themselves too. And it'll be all kind of an online system, so we'll be able to work everything from our smartphones, which will be very interesting um, compared to like the battery-powered timers we currently use. It should be a lot nicer, a lot more energy efficient. Even though it sounds like this is all for the better, are you going to be sad to see the old garden go? I will be very sad to see the old garden go. Um, I think a lot of people will because it's been there for almost 10 years now. Yes. Um, so it'll be, um, you know, kind of a sad day that um, that one is ending um, just because that's the garden since it's begun. That's the one everyone knows. Yes. Um, but, you know, having a new one to kind of start fresh with, you know, I think, I think will be nice for a lot of students as well.